Dragon Con, crispy hair, 30th anniversary, and we're back in the loft, and I found Jodell and Roger, guys. Hey. Thank you for making a Dragon Con. Thank you. That's really pretty excited. cool. So you guys are had some pretty good times recently out in space, and you're kind of grounding it back down here with us in Atlanta. So what have you guys thought so far? It's been amazing. Yeah. Um, I don't know about you, but I've never been to Dragon Con before. Mm. Uh, I've been to lots of other conventions, but I've always wanted to go to this one. Yeah. So I'm very, very excited. It's been awesome. Just one day so far, but one I'm day. looking forward to the rest. Does your one day feel like 10? Is that like how much <laughs> condensed fun you've had so far? Or Maybe like eight and a half. Okay, that's yeah. fair. All right. <laughs> Get off to a good start then. So Roger, how's your weekend going, uh, It's man? been fantastic. Yeah. The, the fans here are great, and we've had nothing but good things to say. And, yeah. You know, ran into some people that just enjoy themselves and yeah. we just tag along and have fun with it. That seems, that seems to kind of be the, the way things go, Flo. Like if you just want to get out of here, no one's going to stop you. Yeah, and yeah, no, uh, yeah, no one's going to be like, yeah, just go out and party and have a good time. Yeah. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, people will stop you. Do they? Okay, no. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. <laughs> so you mentioned you guys do, uh, at this point, done a few conventions now. Uh, I'm assuming thanks to the Dark Matter show, maybe some other stuff. Uh, What's, what's, what's your big convention experiences, guys? What is it that makes you want to keep coming to these conventions? Well, the live interaction with the fans. Yeah. That you yeah. don't get. You know, you, you see meet each other now on Twitter and things right. like that. Yeah, which is awesome. Which is awesome. You're man. still connected. You're still connected. Mm -hmm. But to actually come here and physically say hello to everyone and, mm -hmm. you know, get them to, you know, get to know you. Right. As a real person. It's kind of, I think it's fun for them. It's fun for us. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the pulse of the people, if you will, kind yeah. of thing. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of cool because we get to meet people sometimes that we interact with online and then we meet them in person. Oh, okay. Like somebody at this convention was saying, oh, a friend of mine cosplays your character from Twilight and yeah. I, I knew who she was talking about because I've seen pictures see on that? Instagram yeah. so that was really cool and I just love conventions in general like, yes. I'm happy that I get to go to them because of Dark Matter All but right. I go to them for fun anyway so. So, you, so you've been going as a fan anyways for years yeah then. I cosplay yeah and, well, what, what, what's, what's your big outfits um oh, not, obviously just, not this weekend because you're, uh, you're you're working not this but, weekend but, like, but I just did Princess Mononoke back in Vancouver um, oh I've done yeah. Misa from Death Note Luna Lovegood from Harry Potter mm -hmm. Uh, there's other ones. But <laughs> there's a whole know. repertoire here. Yeah. And I'm really excited yeah, for that. Yeah, so, yeah. so, Roger, what's your costumes? I, I like my kilt, and I put on my kilt, and I go out there, and I'm a Scotsman. <laughs> All right. No, okay. That's <laughs> no, but um, but you also run into other actors that you yeah. know from other shows, or you might have known it, or fans of as well. Yeah. And then you have this great interaction. You get to meet each other in uh -huh. environments like this, where they bring you all together. It's fantastic. It's like a slightly, it's like a giant water cooler of sorts, but yeah. maybe with like, like some alcohol off to the side in some case. Like maybe not the water cooler this maybe time. Not, uh, so yeah, all right, we got you there. <laughs> the water <laughs> shed. <laughs> so and that's really fascinating to me because I mean, obviously you guys work as a pretty close family on yeah. the show, and yeah. then you run into people that you haven't seen in years. Maybe do you get to connect and things yeah. like that. And I love that aspect. Mm -hmm. So, uh, but you mentioned you know that you're also a fan of some of these shows. What's your fandoms? <laughs> so, uh, what, what's all your, of them. All of them <laughs> is the best answer. <laughs> all of the fandoms. Oh goodness! Well, like, um, like, 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 what, like any particular like genre? Obviously, I mean, you get proud off a lot of anime. I do. I love anime. Mm -hmm. um, I like sci-fi as well, though, okay. which is why I'm really happy to be on Dark Matter because <laughs> I get to go to a spaceship every day, and it makes me really happy. That sounds like a pretty fun job. Um, yeah, like it's yeah. similar to you know Doctor Who and Firefly, mm -hmm. which I love. Uh, and oh, I don't know, just everything, yeah. a little bit of everything. So you're literally, this is the right place for you then. Yes. You, you're just gonna, yes. we're gonna see you wandering the halls, hopefully. Oh, you uh, will. Yeah, 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 I there. have yet to go and spend all of my money, which I do at every convention. That, this so is the best thing. I'm very excited to go and buy all of the things. Do you get like collectibles <laughs> or like scrolls or stuff like that? Like um, wall scrolls? I really like getting artwork at the different conventions because if I go to the ones in Vancouver where I live, then you know, it's kind of the same artist every time. Right, you time, see the, but, the same faces. Yeah, right? but then when you go to something in a different country, then there's totally different artwork. So nice. I like to go look at that. Um, it's usually very difficult to bring it back home on the plane, but right. I do it anyway. Yeah, you make it work. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. So, Roger, what's your, what's your fandoms? What's my Yeah, fandoms? what's your geeky things? I, you know, I, I'm more <laughs> of a... I, I love sci-fi as well, right, okay. but I'm a big action We've watched guy. Walking Dead yeah. together. We, oh, yeah. We, Walking we, Dead. Yeah, 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 that's so good. Walking Dead parties. Um, mm -hmm. I, I, the guys from Gotham ran into them last night. Yeah. I, I kind of know them. We have come, yeah. TJ and John was like common directors. And uh -huh. So it, it was kind of, you know, run into those guys and have a conversation last mm -hmm. night. Right, right. It, it's just, a, you know, I'm, I'm a show guy that I, right. I, love, I love good acting. Yeah. 
and I love good stories. And so any of that, no matter what the genre, I like. Mm -hmm. So it's not so much like the, the, the destination or the journey. It's like literally like that world building, good environments and things like that. Yeah. So, yeah. so what's the last thing you binge watch? Did you, binge -watch. Did you are you a binge watcher? Binge -watch. I have family. I can't binge watch. That's a fair much. answer. <laughs> That's all right. Just, all right, everyone's just, asleep. Here's like 15 minutes about. here. You know what I mean? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. You know, but we, you know, we get to, we, you know, record our shows. Right, right, right. Get to watch them. And, um, I mean, Ray Donovan is one of my favorite things. Oh, yeah, not yeah. In this genre. But, no, hey, no, uh, fandom's a fandom. Yeah, you know, and that's a really great you know, show. I mean, and so, yeah, we, we, we like. And we love um, Game of Thrones. All right, there. Game of Thrones. That's a big. That's big in the family house. Game of Thrones is big in the family house. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, <laughs> All right. Yeah, so yeah, keep yeah, an eye on the kids. Make you know, watch what, your wine no, cups. Kids, so. no, the kids don't get to watch. <laughs> Good answer. Kids don't get to watch Game of Thrones. You saved it. <laughs> awesome. They can watch Dark Matter. All right. <laughs> Excellent. So like, so is there like a, a big recent thing that you've done? Are you like a binge watcher yourself? Because we're, we're very much like a binge watching culture now. Netflix, yes. Hulu, all that stuff made, made it convenient to. Can I pick up these products? I don't know any other way to watch things. No. <laughs> I, just, I binge everything that I watch pretty much. It's just um, mainline it. And I mean, I work so much that it's hard for me to watch shows, you know, weekly, like yeah. when they come out. So usually what I do is I'll I'll catch up on things when I'm free. Mm. So yeah, that's pretty much how I watch everything. Well, probably I've been to work. All right, now I've got six hours. Let's yeah. watch everything I can on the thing. I could get so, in half a season of something. Then. Yeah. So do you sleep then or do you just constant like no. just... No. No sleep. That is the best answer. <laughs> well, cool. So, See, no yeah. kids, kids. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a, not having kidding. children myself, I can, I, I can kind of understand See, that. You know, right. there's, there's a lot of work in there and things like that. But yeah, we, we enjoy and we get out there and we watch what we watch. And we love it. So, uh, before we get going though, we're going to start diving into random questions with Randall. This is my buddy Randall. Hey, Randall. He has Hi. collected some questions from the internet and we're going to each of you get to go through one. Hopefully it'll be a little good piece of storytelling here. Okay. So dig on in, draw a Alrighty. random question out of the fishbowl. Right off the bat. Okay. Um, <clears throat> describe the most comfortable pair of socks that you have ever owned. Most comfortable pair of socks. Okay. Well, um, I've got these socks. I don't know if you listen to the podcast, uh, Welcome mm. to Night Vale. Yes. But uh, I have some Night Vale socks. Okay. And, uh, you know, they've got the purple eyes on them with the little moon thing. And they are super comfy. Yeah. <laughs> and they are my favorite socks. So not only comfy socks, but they remind you of a, a, yeah. a pleasant... Geeky, uh, comfy uh, socks. Geeky, comfy are socks. Are the best socks. Awesome. <laughs> And, and they're very vibrant. Are, are, do you, are you familiar with Welcome to Night Vale? No, you have, no, no, I don't think so. Right, is that what it is? <laughs> I love this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so we, have, we have some of those people here, uh, so make sure you try to find them. That would be I awesome. I know, I saw. So that's the panel and, you're going to sneak into. Uh, there's so many. I, I often don't realize until afterwards that there are people here that I would be like <laughs> dying to meet, but uh, I never example. really have that much free time to go and wander around. Well, and I, don't, I just feel, I feel really weird. Like I... I'm a really awkward person when I try to meet people that uh -huh. I admire, so I, I tend to just like avoid when it. When we got a rat doctor, that was yes. funny. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm a total fan. We're like, I'm, 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 okay. I can breathe. <laughs> All right, so let's draw one up for Roger real quick here. Okay. So you get to draw one up from here. No pressure. Uh, you pick this. Hey, the pick goes a spiked one. Spiked. They're all technically spiked. <laughs> yeah. but, you know. A wizard has turned you into an animal. Oh. What animal do you hope to be? Oh. An eagle. An eagle. Why is that? An eagle. I just love them. They're powerful. They're mm. majestic and they soar so high. And they mm. have the eyes that can pick out anything and in a second just... Just pop it. on down there. Yeah. I've got so ferocious, regal, things like that. Yeah. So rock and roll. Amazing. Yeah. Awesome. Well, that's cool. So uh, welcome to Night Vale on an eagle mashup. We're gonna make that happen. So. I, I love that. Let's do it. So, thank you guys so much for making it to Atlanta to Dragon Con your first time. Yeah. I hope you guys have a blast. There's not much time left. It's Sunday, so you better make it count. Yeah. Okay, better make right, it count. All right. Man. Cool. Thank, thank you guys so much for making it out. Thanks so much. Cool. Thank you, and thank you, Dragon Con. Thank you. Thank you, Dragon Con. <laughs>